welcome to code mania the best place to learn best code in a best possible manner like us on facebook facebook slash code mania also find us on youtube youtube.com apex sales force in this session we will discuss about uh, different apex tags uh, first of all apex output text this apex tag is used to uh, display text in a visual force page you can control the uh, style of the text positioning of the text using this apex output text css style mm, also uh, you can uh, control the rendering option uh, in a visual force page for a particular text uh, using this output text let's okay. see how do we mm, use uh, apex output text tag in a visual force page so first of all write apex output text start tag and end tag then uh, you can use value attribute or you can write uh, in between this apex text start tag and end tag so first of all we will use value attribute to um, see how to use apex text like in value attribute mm, we can use uh, please don't modify in this session we are going to view a record Any using visual force page visual force page will decide whether the record will be shown in read only manner or editable manner uh, so for this we need to so add save it https double slash instance id text of the production or sandbox or developer edition uh, now we are control uh, or we are uh, modifying then, uh, the like CSS uh, style ap1 or cs10 or cs20 slash apex slash page name like page name of your visual force page and uh, then question mark and then style id is equal to record id uh, record id of the record you want to style, view uh, we can visual force use page. color and now of we are going to design a visual force page is we will display a record a very important uh, notification in this manner then uh, like we, we don't use uh, font size editable. font size say 12 pt then uh, we can use uh, positioning of the text position F absolute and then uh, we can use or we can display the position in center see and this center tag is not allowed so we are uh, using positioning as a ab absolute and also we can use center here actually center and then center in tag so that the text will text is displayed in a in the center of this page see now we can use another uh, another tag is to make this text as bold like uh, font weight bold see it is a bold font so uh, like this we can use apex output text or uh, uh, if you don't use any center we can place it anywhere uh, using css style see mm. like uh, suppose 
uh, from the left side we want to uh, display in a particular position like left say 100 pt uh, 100 px see we can place the text anywhere actually like this it's a 100 px dis distance or we can use it from the right side also see uh, so uh, we can um, use a text to uh, display in a visual force page and main maintain in position its font its font family also uh, using this ap apex output text also you can write it in between this two apex tag apex start text of output text and in tag of output text but for that you have to uh, externally define the style you cannot use this internal uh, attribute of apex output text this style see it's a simple text if you want to modify it you have to use this style in a paragraph tag Para paragraph tag see see so uh, in this session we are familiar with this apex output text in tag. this session we have uh, included another uh, apex tag name as apex output level let's th see through an a demonstration how to how do we use apex output level see we can uh, writing apex output level then uh, we can use a value attribute for the level to provide the level uh, for a particular field suppose uh, name mm, now s saving the record book level Let's see there must be n tag if you are not using n uh, tag of apex output level then we should um, put a slash at the end of this uh, tag actually see here is name has been appeared uh, a name text has been appeared now we are uh, uh, using this output level for a particular input field or a particular input like mm, suppose we are using a text input so using input mm, tag and then type is equal to suppose text lots of type but there so if you are saving it see name and then uh, and its corresponding value 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 input input tape input uh, field actually now uh, we can position this input text input uh, using CSS style like style uh, position absolute and then mm, from uh, left side it's uh, 300 px see it's a perfectly aligned with name so we can easily uh, use apex output level uh, for apex input or to display the title 
to display the uh, output text level uh, like this or uh, output level for input text it's it's a uh, name and then uh, then value as uh, company so you can keep the input text as same like this uh, also we can use uh, apex output level for a particular uh, uh, to uh, highlight the per information for a particular uh, field or output field or anything like this